All right, let me just real quickly tweet this out. <coughs> yeah, we're going to see uh, that uh, pretty even percents going on right now. sure what kind of strings we're going to see, if at all, any. Like, Villager is... <gasps> oh, wow. So, I really like the idea that Juice went off for that back air, because you get you know, a huge hitbox extension from hitting the balloons, which then just combos into the other balloon, which then just combos into Villager. But, he ended up missing Villager, uh, which is something you want to do, so that he just ends up in freefall. But, the freefall jump did manage to make it to the ledge. So... Still really high percents now. Uh, imagine if he didn't charge that. <coughs> All right, Pokemon uh, paying attention to the last hitbox and the landing hitbox. They are separate. Ooh. Saw that Juice was going to be looking for a short hop bear around him, trying to beat the spot dodge. Uh, didn't give it to him. He nared him away. Ooh, I think the uh, gyro is actually going to be pretty scary. Because, whoa, okay. Did you see that? The, like, backside of the Nair hit him forward. So I guess it's, his Nair just always just hits in one direction. Anyway, something I wanted to point out was I could see the uh, gyro being pretty scary because he shoots it out, and then if Falco reflects it, then he can pocket it, which means it's now double. It's reflect plus pocket multiplier. I'm pretty sure it stacks, and that's really strong. All right, so right now, even stocks. Uh, Pokemon with a slight lead, although you see that Juice is going to be closing that up. Shifting gears now with a small 10% lead. Ooh, Pokemon whiffing the grab. Uh, dodge the F smash. Yep, there we go. We, we were looking for it. That thing is. Alright, never mind. It's not super strong. I take everything back. <laughs> I really thought he was gonna, like, explode. But, doesn't matter. Uh, Pokemon's gonna make his own fireworks with the fair. So we may have had like a small stock lead for a brief time, but Pokemon not going down with the out of fight, uh, trying to turn this around. Whoa. Yeah, I think so too. Zayzen speeds. Woo! All right. Woo! Okay. Ha. All right, so we're getting rid of Kalos and Lilat. So where are we going? We're going to take this time, but we're going to Smashville. All right. He has his constituents here uh, approving of their mayor. They're like, oh, yes, good job. Good job, Mr. Mayor. I really like that pick. Yes, yes, yes. Juice looks bored as hell, but I, I think that's just his resting face. All right, both players immediately at the go run away from each other. That is a, never a good sign to be conducive of a good match. I mean, it can be, but, like, it's not a good sign. Wasn't it well guard? <laughs> it was hella well guard. <laughs> anyway.
Okay. Ooh, I really like they're leapfrogging each other a lot there. Okay. <gasps> wow, scooping him out of the Lloyd spawn and the last hit of fair actually gonna kill him off the side. So now we have a really solid lead for Juice now. Uh, he ha he now can play like a little bit more passive uh, and just like help Pokelem kind of like uh, dig his own grave. Okay. Yeah. Seeing a little bit more passive now. He's not, he doesn't need to be as aggressive and he's just like, he's like, come here boy. You come to me, and I'll, I'll hit you with those sick combos. Depending on your opinion of Falco combos. <sighs> All right. Ooh. Ju that was some great spacing. He basically stopped short being like, if you, if you run into this back air, you'll die. But if you don't, I'll be safe enough that I can escape. Fantastic spacing by Juice. And now we've completely lapped him in percent. While he's at 100, uh, you know, because he's still at that stock lead, he can just keep playing the passive game. And he's still doing a pretty darn good job of it. All right, Pokemon finally going to take that first stock. Now, this is the point where uh, you'll see Juice amp up the aggression just a little bit because he doesn't want to keep trading or anything. Because any trade at that percent is just like, if it doesn't result in the kill, it's just progress for Pokelam. So, uh, ooh, all right. Pokelam trying to come down on an air on him, but uh, it gets eaten by Falco up smash, 8% rule. Gonna just completely stuff it out. So now we have a even greater stock lead, because now he is at low percent for juice. So, ooh. I think Pokelam's gonna be taking a trip to the loser's bracket, but uh, this kid has actually been more than surprising uh, more than a few times. So if we were to get some strong villager kill, we could definitely see something happen. Oh, nope, not going to be enough. I really like that. He just went out super deep, but like he knew that he went too far, so he just tried to get back to the stage as possible to refresh all of his resources. Ooh, that was a quick one. Oh, oh, sorry. Got a 